Hello folks, welcome back to the channel. Today I wanted to give you a little sneak peek of my latest project that I've been working on. It's the Pelican Kayak, the Catch 100. Son got this for Christmas. He's been wanting one for several years and getting that age where I'm trying to teach him uh, about uh, the importance of boat safety and things like that. So got him this little kayak or he got it for Christmas and um, we've kind of went uh, full-fledged and tricked it out. Uh, kind of went overboard more than what I was ever thinking about doing added a trolling motor uh, added a hummingbird helix 7 uh, built some uh, power poles for it and um, i'll go into a different video with that later on got a little Minn Kota endura v2 uh, trolling motor we put on it had to put some hatches in it but overall it turned out pretty well built a little controller there uh, we took the uh, trolling motor apart and built a little controller there got to get a little different uh uh, knob for that but overall uh, looks real good or I think it does he likes it and that's all that matters so he wanted him some power poles he told me daddy I need me some power poles so so I said okay son well we went over to uh, uh, Lowe's and bought some little old lightweight aluminum and, and uh, I built him some waiting on the actual actuators right now but they'll be 12 volt uh, he can say uh, he got power poles now on his ride so uh, overall looks good uh, and uh, does real well he cruises around in the pond it's uh, not for big water or any open water or anything it's just for here at the house in our pond out in front of the house here you can kind of kind of see it here so uh, never big water nothing that's not safe or anything like that um, this weight of these power poles probably added roughly uh, maybe 20 25 pounds they're very very lightweight aluminum um, went over to Lowe's and bought an extendable um, pole we made some some stick steering for him and um, here's the hummingbird we put on that today that's a little helix 7 with uh, down imaging got him a rod holder it's got the yak attack power in it you can see there here's a light here's the controller for it we also have a battery box that we built for it inside this top patch that comes on the the kayak itself you can see the yak power and then we have all the wiring and everything down there um he likes it that's all that matters we uh got to do a few more things to the trailer a little bit of paint and uh, extend the hitch here but uh, overall i'm pleased with it he's proud of it teaching him boat safety he's uh already figured out how to load the thing don't even have to do nothing but so it's uh working so far but appreciate you watching the channel appreciate you uh Checking back in for more videos. Please like, subscribe, um, share this if you want to. Send us some questions. Um, I will do a, another video on the little power poles that I built and how I built those um, and what all was used for that as I get uh, get those 12 volt actuators in there. But they'll be on a little button and they'll uh, be hooked to the battery here. So appreciate you checking with us and. Uh, Look for more videos, take care, stay safe out on the water, and never know uh, what type of impact you're going to do when you're taking a little kid or child fishing or an adult that's never been out on the water or out in the woods. So hunt safe, stay safe, and uh, fish safe, tight lines, take care.